These are chicken lollipops. They're a fun and different way of making chicken drumsticks. And that's what we're grilling today. So how are these guys made exactly? Well, it's not too complicated. So we start with full uh, chicken drumsticks. And the idea is to cut the cartilage and skin uh, right around the bone, pull that off, and then we'll push the meat down to form uh, the ball at the end of the bone, kind of giving it that uh, lollipop shape. So let's get started. For the prep, I like using a, a smaller knife, just makes it easier to cut around. And uh, you just wanna feel around where kind of the meat uh, starts to get thin and cut right all the way around. So you can see the bone right underneath, and now we're just gonna pull all this off. So this is excess skin. There's a little bit of meat on this, uh, but it's mostly skin and cartilage. So uh, once I pull this off, I'm just gonna get rid of it because we won't be needing it. This is what you want your bone to look like. You want to scrape off as much of that cartilage and excess skin. So this would just make for a much nicer presentation uh, when these are done. Now what you're going to do is pull the meat down on this bottom section. Same with the skin. To give it that nice ball shape right on the bottom. If there's anything extra that sticks out, you can just trim this off. Again, this just makes for a nicer presentation at the end. Uh, you know, the, the main appeal of these is the presentation, so I always spend a little bit more time making them look like a true nice round lollipop so they look nicer when they're done. This is what you want it to look like once it's uh, all trimmed up. So again, nicely cleaned bone, uh, your meat and skin pulled down into this uh, ball shape on the bottom. So I'm gonna prep the rest and then we'll start seasoning them up. Our chicken is all prepped and trimmed up. So now I'm gonna season it uh, and I'm gonna be using a Meat Church Honey Hot Barbecue. It's a good uh, sweet rub with a little bit of spice but not too, uh, too overpowering. So let's season these guys up. Just wanna get a nice even coating all the way around. Chicken is all seasoned up, uh, but we are not done just yet. I'm gonna be using this rack actually to cook them. So let me uh, show you guys what this is all about. This guy over here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hang the uh, chicken legs on my rack just like so. So this will allow for a more even cook and will help them retain that nice shape while they're cooking. Uh, I'll put a link in the description for this uh, chicken rack. Uh, I got this on Amazon, it's only a couple dollars, so uh, they're super useful, uh, especially for, uh, for making these. Chicken is prepped, seasoned, and ready for the grill. I'm also gonna sauce these guys up at the end, so one set I'm gonna do with Awasi's uh, mole Q sauce, really tasty, kind of a mix between barbecue and a mole sauce, and the other one with TD's Bruise and Barbecue, Atomic Pineapple, sweet and spicy, really good combination for chicken. 
I've got the egg fired up. So this is set up for indirect cooking with the plate setter grate on top. I'm gonna bring this up to about 350 before putting the uh, chicken lollipops on. Let's get these guys on the egg and get them going. While the uh, chicken uh, lollipops are cooking, I prepped my sauce area. So the easiest way to uh, sauce them is to just dunk them in a couple tier barbecue sauce. I've got one with the atomic pineapple, one with the uh, mole Q, and I just take them off the rack, dunk them one by one, and I'll throw them on for a couple more minutes at the end just to let that sauce thicken up at the end. So these guys are looking really good. They've been on for about 25 minutes or so. I'm gonna start dipping them in the sauce once they hit about, you know, 150 internal or so. Now that the chicken hit 150 internal, we'll take them off and dunk them in the barbecue sauce. Just do it one by one, and then I'll put them back on the rack for about 10 more minutes or so, let that sauce thicken up and finish cooking. Ooh, these guys look awesome. Nice color from the barbecue sauce, they smell amazing. So let's take them off the rack, plate them up, and see how they taste. All right, let's give these guys a test. They look awesome, nice color, nice little ball shape at the end. Now my kids absolutely love these because, uh, well, they're just kind of fun to eat. So let's dig in. Mm. Oh man, that is perfect. Very, uh, very juicy and moist chicken. I'm not sure if you can see that. Very tender. The barbecue sauce really brings it all together. This is uh, the one with the mole sauce, so it's kind of sweet. Um, little hints of chocolate, very, very good. It also, the skin has a really nice bite through. It's not chewy at all, which is exactly what you're looking for when you make these. So that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys liked it. Let me know down in the comments what you think about it. If you did enjoy it, give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button, and thanks again for watching.